Wisconsin out of the Big Ten is the four seed in the East region. They get Wofford. Your preview brought to you by State Farm. It is March. I'm Lauren Shahadi. Steve Lapis, CBS College Sports, joining us now. When you talk about Wisconsin, they're led by guard Trevon Hughes, senior guard Trevon Hughes. He's got to know the ropes by now, Steve, doesn't he? Oh, he's, let me tell you something, there's not, he is a clutch, clutch guy. You look at how he played, he was, he was so bad against Illinois for 35 minutes and then the last five minutes scores 14 points to uh, give him a chance to win in the game. They were down big the whole game. So he's a guy who will come through for you in the clutch. He's great with the ball. He's a good one-on-one -on -one player. He makes threes. He is very, very tough. Tell me a little bit about Wofford's Noah Dolman. What do you expect out of him in the tournament? Well, he's a guy 6'6", six, six, a little bit undersized. He averages almost 17 points and 6 rebounds a game. He's not a three-point shooter. But what this team does in general is they only give up 56 points a game. They are, in a lot of ways, a mirror image of Wisconsin. They don't turn the ball over. They don't score a lot. They don't allow you to score a lot. So this could be a real grind-out game. Um, and they do a good job defending three-point shots. And that's important because Wisconsin does like to shoot the three. Wisconsin didn't play great down the stretch, 5-3. and three. But when you talk about Bo Ryan, he always has his teams ready to go. Talk to me about the job he's done. Well, he's just, you know, interesting statistic. He's been there nine years. They've had nine straight 20-win seasons. In the 105 years before he got there, they only had eight 20-win seasons. So that puts in perspective what Bo Ryan has done at the University of Wisconsin. He runs a swing offense. It's a system. He, when, any, when his name shows up on that board for the NCAA tournament, the other team is saying, oh, I can't believe we have to play these guys. Difficult to prepare for, but even harder to play against. Wow. Any chance of an upset here, Steve? I don't think so. I don't think so because I think his teams are just so solid. I think it's going to be a low-scoring game, uh, but I just think they're too solid and too tough defensively. With John Lohr being back, they got over that injury very well. I think they're going to win this. All right, that game, 250 on Friday. If you are at work, not to fear, CBSSports.com, you can watch it there. Just hide it from your boss. We won't tell. For Steve Lapis, I'm Lauren Shahadi. We'll talk to you soon.